What's up? Welcome back to the channel and in this video we're going to be going over and how to perform a factory reset on your new Samsung Galaxy S21 Plus Ultra. So let's begin with the video now. So what's up everyone, welcome back to Surge Tech, Sergio here. In this channel I do a lot of tech reviews and tutorials, so make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos like this. There's gonna be links to everything that I talk about in this video in the description down below, so do check that out. And let's get right on with the video. So the reason you may wanna do this, maybe your phone is running a little bit slow because you have the storage full and you wanna erase everything to factory condition, or maybe you're gonna give away your phone or trade it in, so you need to erase every single information that you have. So so in this video I'm going to be showing you two methods that you can do this and the first one is going to be through your settings and the second one if you don't know the password of your phone. So the first one is going to be through the settings so I'm just going to go ahead right here on settings and right here on settings you're going to go all the way down to where it says general management. Once you're there you're going to go all the way down to where it says reset and here you're going to see reset all settings. So we're going to press that and this is going to warn you that this is going to reset all the settings on your phone including security, language, accounts, personal data, and settings for downloaded apps. So once you're ready, you press reset settings, and now it's going to be the last warning telling you that all settings are going to be reset to their defaults and can be recovered. To apply new settings, your phone will restart. So once you're ready, you're just going to press reset, and that's going to begin the process. Okay, so now for the second method, let's say that you have a password and you honestly can't remember what the password was, so you can't access to your phone. So we have a way to fix that, all you have to do is perform from the factory reset to erase every single data of your phone and you'll be able to log back in. So in order to do this we're going to press volume down in the block button for about 15 seconds and once those 15 seconds pass volume up and block button as well. So let's begin. Volume down and block button. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Now we let go and we do volume up and block button. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So now that we see the Samsung Galaxy logo, we can just let go. And that is going to take us to this menu. And that's going to take us to the Android recovery menu. So I'm going to put it up close so you can read. In this menu, you're going to be moving with the volume buttons to go down. You go volume down and up, volume up, and to choose or select just the plug button. So we're going to go, so we're going to go all the way down to where it says wipe data slash factory reset. And here, once again, it's going to tell you that if your phone is reset, you may need to enter the Google account information. So once you're there, you're just going to select it with the plug button. This is going to warn you that it's going to wipe all the user data and this cannot be undone. So we just go once, we go down once again and then select and now we can just wait because now the phone is going to start rebooting. So if you check at the bottom, it's going to say data wipe complete. So now we just go up here to where it says reboot system now. So we select that and now our phone is going to be rebooting. So this is only going to take a couple minutes. So let's wait and see. So here you are on the main menu of your Samsung Galaxy S21 Plus Ultra as if it was brand new. Okay everyone, so that's it for the video on how to perform a factory reset on your Samsung S21 Plus Ultra. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a like and leave a comment down below if it helped you out. And don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. And as always, I'll see you in the next one.